Hello everybody. Today we got a unit in Madison. Um, this one here has zero modifications as far as channels, open clarifiers, anything like that. Uh, when I got the radio, it was completely untouched. So I sent it off. It had sat for many years. So I sent it off had all of the electrolytic capacitors replaced, even in the power supply section, um, with good Nichicon um, style caps. Some are Nichicon, some are other ones, Rubicon and stuff like that. But they're all good quality caps. So I had all the caps re replaced and the two meter lights were changed to LEDs so they last long. All the controls cleaned, lubricated. Um, one of the... Uh, downfalls to this radio is back behind the faceplate here there's a high wattage resistor that gets really hot and that's what causes a lot of the failures with the clock functions well the resistor is behind the front panel here so it holds heat instead of being on the back of the circuit board back inside here where it can vent and cool so that's one of the uh, uh, service bulletins from Uniden so I had that done as well, just so that this thing's ready to go. Um, the radio is still 100% stock as far as um, no audio limiters have been clipped, no extra channels have been installed, no open clarifiers, nothing like that. A lot of these, a lot of times, these radios um, are sought after by collectors, and I figure I'd leave it 100% original, except for the caps and the LEDs. Um, and if you wanted to peak it up and have it swing in more watts, you could do that, clip in the audio limiters or whatever you would like to do. But I personally don't like to do that. So I just figured I'd leave this one well alone. The meter lights light up really nice. All the LEDs light up really good. Really good looking radio. You can see... Um, behind me here it actually looks really cool at night but with the leds kind of lights up in the vents so it looks really nice at night uh let me uh give you a quick demonstration here so like i said it's it's all stock power Twenty watt scale, AM, dead key in four. <whistles> audio, hello, audio, swinging 10, 12 watts. Go to sideband here, flip it over to uh, sideband. Audio, hello, audio swinging almost 20 on sideband and again there's no limiters clipped so you know you clip the limiters you could get you know 15 20 watts of swing on am but you don't need it you don't need it it's not really going to notice any difference so uh with that being said let's see here i have um it's right on frequency on sideband audio check one two three hello check one two three audio radio that is a icom 756 pro that's on behind me so that you could hear the transmit and we'll see if anyone's out here so you can hear the receiver receiver is really nice too It does have the original Madison speaker as well. So, uh, it's a really good, clean Madison. Uh, the newer version with the digital clock, too, as you can see. So uh, this will be, well, oh, it comes with the uh, original uh, unit and hand mic as well. Um, this will be packed very well. I pack all my items really good. 
so you don't have to worry about that. It will be packaged correctly. Uh, the auction is going to include uh, free shipping, also insured, so no worries there either. And uh, this is going to probably ship FedEx. So thank you so much. Again, very nice, clean uh, Madison radio here. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do it. Uh, I always have something new, something going on, new videos and stuff like that. Thanks a lot. Take care. 73s.